Her har vi da jettetrøst. For de som ikke vil ha en bautrøster sånn som bauer nå i hekken, så er det muligheten å ha en pumpe sånn som midt i båten. Og så kjører den da som en uh, vannjett da. Pumper den vannet inn, bak. Og så fordeler den da til dysene foran, eller akter. Så velger du da om det er høyre eller venstre side. Den her ser ut som har en uh, manuell switch der. Ikke manuell, det er nei, nei, jeg er automatisk. Ja. Eller, du må jo styre den, så det er jo styremekanismen. Så velger du om det er syrebord eller babor uh, jetrøst. Den er sannsynligvis en treveisventil, stengt. Eller den, eller den veien. Og samme der, stengt, eller den, eller den veien. Så det er samme pumpa, alle fire steder, og da åpner en av de, så løper pumpa på det hørte. Det som er interessant hørte. med jetbåter og jetmotorer, er at du trykker trenger når det vil sikkert være under vann. Det er over vann, så de dysene er sånn, de kan stå over vannlinja. Så du har null friksjon. Og det er interessant for oss som seiler. Så du blir kvitt all den der friksjonen. Ok, nå har du jo disse bautrøstene hvor luka går når den kommer ut, så det fungerer jo fint det også. Men da har du jo tross alt batteribanken og vekten og plassen oppe i forpiggen. Her kan du legge det midt i båten, og så har du bare slangevekten fram. Det er fordelen. Og så kobler du det på litiumbatterier og generator og hele midten her sånn. Så, så har du muligheten til å styre og, og legge opp dette på en helt annen måte enn den tradisjonelle metoden. Og hvis nabbåten legger alle fornærme, så kan du bare spille bort. Det kan du bare spille bort. Mm. Now, what do we have here? The Just Truster Micro is a new product? Yes, correct, yes. Uh, we are for more than a decade on the market with Jet Truster. But today, this year, this event, we are showing to you and to the public uh, the new Jet Truster Micro, specially designed for smaller boats. We know that there are many small boats and we have especially designed for this a smaller product which is more easy to place. Fantastic. Show me how it works. Well, I can... What is a small boat? Okay. Um, we have designed the product for smaller boats and under the smaller boats we are considering boats from 25 to 28 feet uh, or boats that you can place on a trailer. Especially for the American market, we know there are so many boats that they keep on a trailer and drive to the lake uh, these boats uh, sometimes have a need for additional thrust or maneuverability. For those boats, we have designed this new Jet Truster Micro. Uh, I can explain you how this works. Yes. Everything is included inside this pump unit. Uh, the pump unit is uh, also protected with an IP cover, which means it has an ignition protection. That's important for exactly. petrol. Yeah. For petrol engine areas, for petrol boats that run on petrol fuel, this is a certified safe product where normally the thrusters need to have an IP enclosure yes. in addition to the product. Yes. We standard offer this on our products. That's clever. The pump unit itself will suck in the water from underneath the boat. And you can see here, we have here a little uh, demo. This is, uh, this is the water intake that will go on the underside of the boat and will be installed inside the product here to fix the whole assembly into the hull. After you start it, you will see that the water will be distributed to the left port or to the starboard side, where of course the water will exit through the nozzle. This nozzle is a very small through hole, basically a normal through hole, only with an angle. Yeah. So it means that you can put it in almost any boat. We you have, have different types of nozzles, fixing exactly, yes. all angles. Yeah. 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 We have uh, 0, 25, 35, 45, 55 degree angles. Yeah. So it means from traditional wooden boats up to modern fiberglass boats, we will always have a range of nozzles that you can place this product in. Do you need to have an Below or above the waterline? Good question. Uh, the benefit of the jet thruster is that this nozzle only has to be 10 centimeters below the water level. All right. Exactly. This is gr for great for a um, uh, situation where you have limited draft. Normally, you would need to place a tunnel thruster under the waterline. Yeah. Sometimes this is impossible. Yeah. Now, with the jet thruster nozzle, you can put that all the way to the front. Yeah. So you have maximum effect of the thrust. Yeah. More leverage, more momentum. More well. leverage, yeah. more momentum. And still not the problem with the draft because this will be just below, below the waterline. Yeah. Um, of course, this product is certified with CE, so boat builders can install this and add this to their, of course, option lists. Uh, to make it safe, we have, of course, a ball valve on the nozzles, so yeah. you can totally shut this uh, close from the outside water. And we have an uh, open close valve uh, with the pump casing itself. It means the customer can open and close 
and the display on the joystick will just give you the information if the pump is open, functional, or if the pump is closed when it's red. Do you have to do that manually or can you control that from the jet register terminal? This is a manual operation. That's a so manual operation. A manual yeah. operation to physically open and close the valve. Okay. So you have um, to do that. Uh, you have to do that, like you normally also would for your engine, yeah, uh, sure. water, cooling water, or yeah. your toilets, or everything yeah, else. Yeah, sure. yeah. Also included with the product, we have a remote control, okay. standard. Yeah. And to give you a little demonstration, uh, when I push the button, we have here a water demo with exactly the pump on it, and it All will right, run. Yeah. So I will push the button. Yeah, I can see, that's a lot of power. It has power, yeah. yes, absolutely. Push the button, yeah. you push the joystick, and there you go. And for the batteries, how much battery do you recommend for yep. this that's size? A good, good question. Uh, what we uh, developed is a one battery necessary. necessary. Yeah. Uh, only one 12 volt battery is required to power this product. All right, yeah. We strongly recommend a Optima Yellow battery because this battery is a very powerful one, very small, reliable and you can have a very deep uh, discharge of the battery uh, before you need to recharge it, okay. recharge this. Uh, only one battery is sufficient to power this high, uh, uh, this strong water pump. Um, uh, the, the water pump uh, itself um, is uh, drawing uh, um, uh, 12, uh, 12 volts. Yeah. So the final question then, uh, what about uh, the weight? And do you have a weight uh, comparison to a normal uh, boat thruster system? Exactly. The motor inside this casing is the same motor that is used for boat thrusters because it's a DC motor working with battery power. Yeah. So the weight is similar. The complete assembly of this product is weighing only 12 kilograms. All right. Yeah. Of the pump unit, of course, the nozzles and the hose in addition yes. will, uh, will, will add to that weight. But you consider it to be about 25 kilos in total. In total? Yeah. 25 kilos? Yeah. For this uh, and reason, if you want front and back, then you have to have two separate systems, or you, you go for the next model up. Yeah, if you want to have two systems for, yeah. uh, for front and back, you need two systems. Yeah. Uh, because this is a development where we have only two axes, yeah. one to the port side, one to the starboard side. Yeah. So yes, you can place two systems inside the boat. Okay. Uh, and then it means you can go sideways with the boat or rotate the boat on the pivoting point. Yes. Yeah. We have for the customers all over the world, uh, we have made it very easy. We are introducing this uh, product in one box. All right, yeah. Uh, it means that you will have the product, all its components, such as the cabling, joystick, remote control, the hose, yeah. 10 meters, the pump itself, also the whole saw set to make the drill the holes. Yeah. Everything is included. This is so the you can only actually have this as a DIY. Yes, that is the whole reason. We yes. wanted to have a technical product, but with a great DIY capability. So technical people in your country, in Norway, will be able to fit these thrusters themselves without the use of any fiberglass or you know, dangerous epoxy or you yeah. know, for your danger for the health, of yes. course, uh, with the epoxy. Very good. Yeah. Okay.